So a, a common buzzword you'll probably hear is something like a, a functional medicine doctor or an integrative medicine doctor or just those genres in general um, uh, as far as when it comes to what kind of medicine somebody is practicing or what, uh, what a patient is using to help heal themselves. I'm, I'm using a very functional medicine approach or an integrative medicine approach. Um, so a lot of these uh, um, buzzwords kind of come into play and, and they're all kind of taking little bits and pieces from each other. Uh, so functional medicine uh, is very comparative to naturopathic medicine. Uh, functional medicine is more commonly used in, in a Western sense, in a conventional um, medicine sense, um, to separate it from uh, conventional medicine. And in, like an umbrella arching term for conventional medicine is drugs and surgery. Uh, it, you know, you see a doctor and really the only thing they're, that they're going to do is, um, is prescribe a drug or refer to a specialist um, who might you know, suggest surgery or something like that. Um, so in, in, a, in a nutshell, like that's a, a very conventional sense. Uh, it's treating the symptom. It's trying to get rid of that symptom, uh, symptomatic real and uh, really quick. It's not really addressing much more than that, whereas a functional approach is something that uh, MDs um, are adapting to say, I, we need to take a different look at this. We need, to, uh, we need to start looking at a person's diet and their lifestyle and really try to start getting to the root cause, which a lot of you may recognize is very similar to what naturopathic medicine uh, has been doing over the past uh, few hundred years. So really the, the terms are pretty synonymous. They're pretty uh, similar in their approach uh, to helping heal a patient. Uh, uh, there's probably a, a couple minor um, nuances uh, between the two, uh, but really the, the, the main overarching theme is that you're taking a big, uh, deep dive into the person's diet and lifestyle and, and doing things to try to get to the root cause of their, of their ailment or disease. Um, integrative medicine is kind of, uh, kind of right up there with all, all of them. It's, it's using, just as, it, as it's titled, an integrative approach. So it's grabbing from um, naturopathic medicine and functional medicine and maybe Chinese medicine and it's in integrating all these different therapies um, into one approach to help a patient. I would call myself an integrative therapist. Um, my degrees in naturopathic medicine and Chinese medicine um, are incorporated a lot. My education in those fields are incorporated a lot. I do a lot of biological medicine, which is stuff like in, uh, exosomes and stem cell therapy. Uh, so I'm always weaving all these into into my approach to helping a patient uh, heal. Uh, so those are uh, a couple of the biggest differences. You know, just to recap, functional and integrative is using all kinds of different therapies, whether it's uh, from maybe Ayurvedic uh, to maybe some pharmaceuticals uh, to help accomplish a goal. Um, so hopefully that clears it up. Um, when you're looking at shopping around for a doctor and you see things like functional and integrative, you can kind of have a better idea of what questions you may ask them or what is it they're going to be doing for you. So any questions or comments, please leave a, leave a comment down below and we can get to it. And uh, we'll see you in the next video.